Hey, how's it going, y'all? Welcome back to another video, man. Today we're gonna be installing the front license plate mount. Damn, bro. Hold on. So as you can see, I was a little too excited to show y'all, but we got a front license plate mounting frame that we're gonna be installing on the Model 3 today. I uh, got this joint from Amazon. You already know, about 20 bucks, man. And we're about to just see how it all comes together. So the kit itself comes with instructions, um, comes with three separate pieces that you're gonna be installing. And it comes with a bunch of screws and a little Allen wrench and all that, all that good stuff. So we're gonna be going ahead and just installing it. So these are the instructions it comes with. They're actually pretty dog shit, not even gonna lie, man. I do not understand any of this and it's in perfect English. Like it's not like a bad translation or anything. I just think it's not very instructive. So I went ahead and clicked on the QR code in the top right and tried to watch the video, but unfortunately there's no words in the video. They just decided to play rock music loud as shit. So. Basically, this is gonna be my version of the tutorial. It's literally only three of these pieces right here and then everything's just screwed in. So I feel like I could just figure it out without any instructions, but let's just do it anyways. All right, man, so first things first, let's check out where we're gonna be placing it. So in my humble opinion, I would assume we're gonna be placing it right on these two ones. I'm not sure if it's gonna be on the inside or the outside of them, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be these front two little gaps right here that we're gonna be placing it at. So it turns out the instructions really aren't that bad. I'm just a bit slow, but you can clearly see that um, these things are gonna be on the inside and then the little hook part is gonna be on the outside of it. I don't know if I'm really making sense, but yeah, you can see like the hook part kind of curves outwards. And I assume I'm gonna be putting the bolt in between those little holes to keep it stuck in place, man. So let's go ahead and do that right quick. All right, guys, so we're gonna be using these front two right here directly in the middle. Just go ahead and stick it in. Uh, let's see if it goes in. Oh, there we go. And then it hooks over, so. Yes, sir. That's one in there. Let's do the other one. There we go. So now that we got those joints in, it looks like all we're gonna be doing is putting in those screws. I just spent 10 minutes looking for my fucking screwdriver and of course it's just sitting in my dirty ass chair, man. For this part, like just getting these little hooks on, it says to use the longer screws with a washer. And if you're a dumbass, the longer screw, it's the longer one. And the washers are these things. So you put this thing wrapped around here like you learned in FLE. And then, uh, yeah, just install them. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to do it right now. All right, so now I'm standing in a very awkward position, but we have the screws with the washers on them. We got two of them. Just gonna go ahead and screw them in right now. Hey man, turns out I'm an idiot. You can't use a screwdriver, you gotta use an Allen wrench, man. But it comes with it, so it's all good. Since I can't really properly record this part, let me just show you guys. Got the Allen key in there. We're just screwing it into the other side. And god damn does this fucking lip kit I have on make it fucking hard as shit to put this joint on, but hey, we're gonna get it. Jeez, finally, we got one in there, man. Now it's time to do the other side. Left joint going on right now, man. We screwing it in. Oh my god, I hate this lip kit. Dude, who the fuck created the Allen key? Why are we not using regular fucking screwdrivers, bro? Like, why am I using this tiny piece of shit that's hurting the fuck out of my thumb, bro? Like, it's so annoying. Using an Allen key in 2024 is crazy, bro. Like, we have so much technology. Drill, screwdrivers. Like, why? Why is this being used, bro? Like, this is really pissing me off. Like, we did it, man. It's probably been, like, 30 seconds in this video, but it's been, like, 30 minutes in real life, bro. Not for this side, for this left side. I guess it's because I'm not left-handed or whatever, and also lip kick on the way, but hey, man, we finally got them on there. So now let's go on to the next part. All right, so the next part is to be easy. We're literally just putting this metal piece in between it right here. Oh, damn, hold up. We're going to be putting it in between right here. And then, oh, my God. We're just going to be screwing it on right here with the washers. And there goes my paper. So basically with this piece, we're gonna be putting it like over the outside of this and then just screwing it in with these bad boys. Yeah guys, so now we're literally just screwing on basically the last part, the part that's actually gonna hold the plate itself. 
And unfortunately, we're still using this goddamn Allen wrench, man. Why couldn't they just use regular screws is beyond me. Alright guys, so we got it on there. I thought it was going to be a lot easier, but it was actually a little bit more difficult because of the lip kit and also because they threw me another curveball giving me a fucking Allen wrench. But it's on there, man. So now we're going to focus on putting the plates on and just get it looking official, man. Alright, man. And we're all done, bro. As you can see right now, I got the plate covered. I can't let the ops get one up on me, man. But basically, you can see that the cover is on there. That shit's secure. It's tight, man. Whatever you want to say, bro. That shit is on there, bro. And it is not coming off, man. So I hope y'all enjoyed, man. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out. Mm -hmm.